Hello guys and welcome back to the another video of MySQL databases. So in this video we are going to learn what is the difference between command truncate and just deleting records manually or just deleting all the requests using you know delete command. So first of all let's have a look uh, at our table and the records just uh, tab select start from users okay we have six entries in in this table so the id is one two three four five and six so let's first uh, try to delete this field and then try to insert the data in this field so let's tab delete from the table name this tag uses and then enter now table is empty let's have a look yeah it's empty now we are going to enter some data in this table so I click and paste and then enter all right now let's have a look at table again as you can i know you as you can see uh, we just enter five entries in this table and the id starts from six uh, you know seven eight nine ten eleven and in before deleting the records from table we at the end you know id one two three four five six and then it continues so if you want to make the table you know whole new you know it's completely phased so then we we can use trinket command so now just type trinket word trinket t and the name of table users enter let's have a look at table there yes table is entry let's try to insert some records into table switch this again and then enter now let's have a look uh, at table structure sorry table data start select now you can you know you can notice that now id it starts from one two three four five so this is the key difference between tanker table we delete data from table using tanker command then what uh, now it table will be have like a new table and the key will start from one two three four five and so on so thank you for watching this video guys in the next video we will learn how to add a table which is a part uh, of SQL uh, no doubt so thank you for watching see you then